Hello everyone, we would like to present a speech advertisement of Thailand, or commonly known for the land of smiles. Thailand is located at a strategic crossroads in Southeast Asia. With an area of over 200,000 square miles, Thailand is the second largest nation in Southeast Asia. Topographically, Thailand presents a varied landscape of forested mountains, dry plateaus, fertile river plains, and sandy beaches. Mountain ranges extend along the border with Myanmar and down to Malaysia. Another range splits the country in half from north to south. With a population of 67,200,000, Thailand is divided into 67 political provinces, with Bangkok being the political, commercial, industrial, educational, as well as entertainment capital. Language called Siamese, the standard spoken and literal language of Thailand belonging to a Thai language family. Thai is spelled in T-A-I. Thai language is based largely on the dialect of Bangkok. Other dialects are spoken in other major regions of the country. Thai words are predominantly monosyllabic but many are polysyllabic. There are 21 consonants and 9 vowels. The vast majority of people in Thailand are adherents of Buddhism. The Theravada tradition of Buddhism came to Thailand from Sri Lanka and is shared by peoples in Myanmar, Laos, Cambodia, and parts of southern China and southern Vietnam. The community of monks or Sangha is central to this tradition. Other famous festivals in the country that make the Thailand culture and tradition so popular are Songkran, or known as the Water Festival, Loi Krathong, or known as the Festival of Lights, Yipeng Festival, Mangha Puja, and Visaka Bucha, or known as the Buddha's Birthday. In the past, Indian culture had a strong influence on Thai literature. Until the mid-19th century, Thai literature was mostly oriented with religion and was written in verse. The only educated classes capable of writing Thai verse were the elite or royalty. Sun Tan Phu, 1786-1855, a poet and well-liked commoner was another important character in Thai literature. Now, in today's time, Thai literature became famous if we view the fact that they are one of the Asian countries that promoted boys' love stories. Thai boys' love is a local adaptation of Yaoi, a Japanese homoerotic literary genre centered on romance stories between a manly guy referred to as uke and a more feminine boy referred to as seme. This Japanese subculture first arrived in Thailand in the form of novels a decade ago. Boys love readers existed long before the culture was brought to the small screen. Together the series, so does the series, love sick the series are just a few of Thailand's most famous BL series or stories. Thailand is indeed a hidden gem when it comes to the music. Its musical traditions are very diverse, impressive, and worth exploring. Though Thailand was never colonized by Western powers, pop music and other forms of European and American music have become extremely influential. The two most popular styles of traditional Thai music are Lukthong or Thai country music which was developed in the mid 20th century to reflect daily trials and tribulations of rural Thais. And Morlam, the dominant folk music of Thailand's northeastern Isan region, which has a mainly Lao population. Lukthung and Morlam have so much in common, such as they depict the life of the rural poor. It influenced the musical traditions of other countries in Southeast Asia. It not only borrows but also inspires countries like China, India, Laos, Myanmar, and Cambodia. The many genres of music in Thailand include pop, jazz, rock, cultural, classical, and hip-hop. Another interesting part of Thai music is their music festivals where a combination of fun and showcasing of talents are witnessed. 
some of which are Wahin, uh, Festival, Wonderfruit, Water Zonic, and S20 Song Grand Music Festival. Wat Aron. The name Wat Aron means Temple of Dawn. It is built to honor Aruna, the Hindu god represented by the radiations of the rising sun. It is located in Bangkok, Yai District, on the west of Chow Phraya River. The central prang rises more than 85 meters high. Muko Ang Thong. Ang Thong means bowl of gold. It is a famous national park in the Gulf of Thailand. It is best for island hopping and travelers can stay in lovely bungalows while enjoying the incredible views of the surrounding islands and rock formations. They can also enjoy the white sand beaches and try snorkeling. Ayutthaya Historical Park This famous tourist attraction holds the ruins of the second capital of Siam. By 1700s, Ayutthaya became one of the largest cities in the world with 1 million inhabitants. In 1967, the city was destroyed by Burmese army but luckily, renovations began in late 1960s and restored its former glory. Visitors can now experience the array of architectural styles of the park. 